Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. Former Arsenal hero Paul Merson has been left wondering why Liverpool have not made a move for Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. The Gunners' captain is out of contract in just over a year's time and Mikel Arteta could be forced to cash in on his star man. Jurgen Klopp worked with Obama Yang at Borussia Dortmund before taking the Liverpool job in October 2015. In the Germans' first season at Anfield his former player found the net at Anfield in the famous 4-3 Europa League win that saw the Reds reach the semi-finals with a last-minute winner. Merson has questioned why Klopp has not made use of that relationship and brought Obama Yang in to bolster his attacking contingent. Everyone knows about Obama Yang's contract situation but there aren't too many clubs in England looking to fill that position, Merson told Sky Sports. Just in, Liverpool may have finally found their Nabil Fekir who could save Jurgen Klopp millions Klopp is still yet to sign a striker at Liverpool and continues to operate with Roberto Firmino as a false nine. The Brazilian is the man who makes the European champions tick and he has set a new benchmark for playing without a goal-scoring centre-forward. Yet Merson believes Liverpool would benefit more from having a player with the output of Obama Yang, who is likely to score over 25 goals per season, a feat Firmino has managed just once since joining from Hoffenheim. Let's be honest, they haven't got a natural striker, Merson added. Sadio Main, Mohamed Salah and Roberto Firmino work really well together as a three, but you do need someone who can bang in 25 goals without a fuss. Firmino is a top player but he can go long periods of time without scoring, you still need someone who is a safety net in terms of goals and that's what Obama Yang can provide. Liverpool also need to continue to improve. Winning trophies is hard, but coming back and winning them again is even harder. There's a company out there that sells more burgers, more chips and more fast food than anyone in the world but they still do adverts. That tells me you have to keep working to stay on top. When you win something, you've got to go and improve again. Some teams go and keep the faith in the squad that won and go from there, but you have to keep improving if you want to stay on top. The burger company don't do adverts to sell stuff, they do it to stay on top. Liverpool will have to do the same and that may mean freshening up the squad. Let's block ads. Why?